everybody. This is Daryl, a.k.a. The D from the Simply Incredible Podcast. And tonight, well, it's almost night. <laughs> Today, I have a new comic book day haul. Uh, I went to Roanoke just to hit a few places. While I was there, I went ahead and hit the, the new store that I had been talking about going to when I picked up a few new books last week. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and uh, pick up a few new books. And also one Funko Pop vinyl. We'll do that first. We have the Breast Cancer, what is it called? Breast Cancer Re Research Foundation Batman in the pink. Which they, there is a Batman pink when they did the rainbow group. But I picked that up to go with my Breast Cancer Research Foundation Harley Quinn. So that way I've got, I've got the pair of them. I don't know if there's any more that came out for this, but I just really want the Batman and the Harley. So now I've got those. Yes. <laughs> uh, next is my comic book haul. I picked up um, like three back issues and then everything else was new. We'll go with the back issues first. I don't know who did this cover, but it is Batgirl number two from the New 52. That was a great cover. So I went ahead and picked that up. Uh, it's something about rain covers. I, I just feel like they look amazing. And to me, everything about this is great. And not only that, Gail Simone uh, did the writing in that, which I got to be honest, I didn't even realize that because the two other back issues... We're also Gail Simone. Uh, Birds of Prey number 66 and 67. I'm kind of slowly putting together a run of these, the uh, the Simone, Gail Simone era. The thing is, I don't know if she started from issue one or not. I don't believe she did. Uh, that was 66 and here is 67. So I'm just going to try to you know, kind of, again, I'm slowly piecing the, the run together. There it is. I don't know if there's any really big issues. Uh, this is a Greg Land cover. And who did this one? Um, Bray Toy? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know who that is. Okay, now the new books. We start off with uh, the Joker issue two. I don't have Joker issue one, so this might be useless, but I thought it was kind of a cool cover. Right there, I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, I really don't, I still haven't really read anything with um, Punchline, but I thought it was a cool cover. I do have, do I have that entire Punchline running in Batman? I can't remember if I do or not, I think I do. I might be missing one issue, but uh, I still haven't read it, so I will have to get on that. Okay, this is Punchline Chapter 1, apparently, because on the inside of the last page, it says, coming up, Punchline Issue 2, or Chapter 2, excuse me. New comic book smell. I like old comic book smell better than new comic book smell. Snail. Comic book smell. Uh, they had this one there. Uh, Harley Quinn. This is Future uh, Future State issue two. And this is the A cover. Since they had it, I'd go ahead and pick that up. Uh, crossover. I have not read any of these. I have heard the story is amazing. They did not have issues one or two, but they did have issue three. And this is the uh, B cover, or is that a second print? Uh, it's a second print. There you go. And they had issue four. And I guess this is just the A cover. Yeah, that's just the A cover on issue four. So I went ahead and picked that up. And uh, let's see. Uh, Batman White Knight presents Harley Quinn. This is book five. 
I uh, picked up book six last week. I don't think I have uh, the first four. I don't think. I'm not sure. I, I, I'm honestly, I don't remember if I stopped getting new books. I'm pretty sure at this point I had already stopped getting the new books. So, guess I'm gonna have to find those first four. Uh, and the last two books, I was uh, I'd heard about this, so I was like, I, I, they had. I went speechless there for a second. <laughs> they had issues one and two, so I picked them up. Swamp Thing, excuse me, the Swamp Thing. Issue one. Great looking cover. Infinite Frontier. V. Perkins Spicer. Oh, and by the way, on the back, uh, Superman with Lois and Clark. Superman and Lois, excuse me. I have not seen any of this. Let me know, is that even good? I have not seen any of it. Anyway, back to Swamp. And we got issue two. Huh. The Kubert School is looking for penciling. There you go. So I think another one had something else on it. Yeah, this one. Insiders look, uh, uh, insiders look, not they're looking for. Uh, this one is for penciling. And this one is for inking. I think I saw this one today at their shop. So, and they were just on the backs of those DC books. So I thought that was pretty cool. So anyway, that is my little new comic book day haul. Uh, I was, they had this last week and I was like, eh, I'll pass on it. So I saw it again today is the last one they had. So I went ahead and picked it up. I just think it's pretty cool. Uh, anything to, I know this, this isn't directly going to them because secondary market, but anything to help kind of show support for everyone suffering through breast cancer or any other kind of cancer, you know, you try to help when you can. It's not much, but you know, we try, right? We try. It's all we can do is try. But that's all I got. And you guys have an incredible day.